Many in Anchorage have been waiting for police to wear body cameras for years, and as some officers are preparing to be fitted for them right now, Steve Kirch was at an Anchorage Assembly meeting tonight where members voted on a proposal relating to the release of body-worn camera footage. Steve. Joe, in a tight vote, 7 to 5, the Assembly approved a resolution urging the police department to reconsider its policy regarding the release of body-worn camera recordings. The policy states that the chief of police decides the release of body camera footage. The resolution passed tonight formally asked the Anchorage Police Department to create a timeline for the automatic release of footage. Those who voted against the resolution say the policy change could send a message of distrust in the police. Those in favor saying when voters approved funding for body-worn cameras in 2021, there was an expectation for transparency and accountability. Now, historically, you know, simply because this is a new policy, a new program for APD, we don't have a history with this department. I don't have a reason to doubt uh, that the chief of police will act in good faith to release footage uh, when it is in reasonable and in the public's interest to do so. What people are asking is very specific, is that we want to see body cam recorded recordings of critical incidents where the police use deadly force or they cause ser serious bodily injury. That is what people are asking for. Now, 30 cameras could be on officers as soon as November 13th, with the eventual deployment of 320 additional cameras. There will also be an installation of in-car cameras.